out again. So let's get it. Hello guys today in this video, we are going to help you to find out the best blenders in market. I made this list based on my personal opinion and I tried to list them based on their quality, durability, customer review and more. If you want to see their price and find out more information about them, you can check our links in the description below. Number 10. Canon EOS Rebel T7 DSLR. The camera with the quality your photos deserve, the EOS Rebel T7 can be ideal for smartphone or digital point-and-shoot camera users looking to step up their imaging game. It's equipped with a 24.1 megapixel CMOS image sensor for highly detailed, vibrant photos and videos even in low light. Whether you're out on an adventure hike or snapping candids of your friends during a late night out, the EOS Rebel T7 can help you take photos you'll want to show off. Built-in Wi-Fi and NFC connectivity makes it easy to share, print, or get your favorite pictures up on select social media sites for your friends, family, and the world to see. If you're new to DSLRs, Scene Intelligent Auto Mode can conveniently and automatically adjust the camera's settings to suit your subject. Number 9. A Queso EK7000 4K Ultra HD Action Camera Professional 4K 30fps and 2.7K 30fps video with 16MP photos at up to 30 frames per second for incredible photos, which is four times the resolution of traditional HD cameras. Wireless Wrist Remote Control Sports Camera With a Wrist 2.4G remote, you can capture the world in an all-new way. Controlling the camera, framing shots or recording video is convenient. The remote is not waterproof, longer battery life. A Queso EK7000 action camera comes with two rechargeable 1050 mAh batteries. Each battery can record up to 90 minutes. No more worry about the recording time for this action camera. Number 8. Panasonic Lumix FC300. 4K video and 4K photo. Panasonic's exclusive 4K photo technology uses 30 frames per second in high-resolution 4K Ultra HD video to extract them as photos, you'll never miss that moment again. Like a DC Vario Elmerit lens, 24x zoom, 25-600mm with full zoom range f2, 8 aperture for enhanced low-light shooting meeting the stringent quality standards established by Leica. High image quality, the 12.1 megapixel high sensitivity MOS sensor with the Venus engine excels in diffraction compensation, yielding images that are crisp and free from artifacts associated with small aperture settings. Rugged camera design, splash proof slash dust proof rugged camera design with tight seals on every joint, dial, and button, so it stands up to harsh weather conditions and challenging. Number 7. Canon EOS. Perfect for beginners, this camera bundle offers the essential tools needed to take your SLR skills to new heights, all in one convenient package. No matter where your next adventure takes you, count on the EOS Rebel T7's impressive 24.1 megapixel CMOS sensor and wide ISO range of 1006400H12800 to capture high quality images, even in low light situations. 24.1 megapixel CMOS APS-C sensor with its 100 to 6400 H12800 built-in Wi-Fi and NFC technology, 9.0 AF system and AI servo AF optical viewfinder with approximate 95% viewing coverage. Number 6. Kodak PixPro Astro. Discover the new collection of Kodak PixPro digital cameras and discover a world of creativity at your fingertips. The AZ255 is the perfect bridge camera to explore your love of photography. Ample megapixels, 25x optical mega zoom and a wider angle lens than traditional models, this camera could easily become your new best friend. 
Kodak PixPro Digital Cameras Tell Your Story Up to 25 megabytes per second write speed and class 10 speed ratings for full HD video recording and high-resolution pictures. Up to 32 gigabytes storage capacity. Number 5. Kodak AZ-401. You'll get well-defined, detailed images thanks to the AZ-401 16 million pixels. That's ample resolution to crop, zoom, or enlarge your photos however the photographer in you desires. With a 24mm wide-angle lens, there's no sacrificing what you want in the frame. So go ahead and let your camera see what you see, the sky's the limit. The optical image stabilization will iron out any small movements as you're focused on getting your shot, so you never have to be afraid to go for what you want. Whether you're in the moment or modifying your work at a later time, the bright, 3-inch LCD screen ensures that you end up with just what you're looking for. Capture everything in your peripherals with the 180-degree panorama feature. 860 Focal Length Number 4 Panasonic Lumix FZ80 While the best cameras for beginner photographers are interchangeable lens models, costs can quickly add up when you have to invest in a camera body, lenses, and other gear like extra batteries, memory cards, and maybe even a tripod. If you'd rather buy a cheap all-in-one camera that still gives you an SLR-like shooting experience, consider a budget bridge camera like the Panasonic Lumix FZ80 which is a relatively cheap camera that still offers a lot of value for its price, while bridge camera sensors aren't too far off from modern smartphone cameras in terms of image quality. The glass on this thing will give you much more zoom than is possible with most phone cameras. It also provides a more comfortable shooting experience, and having a viewfinder to shoot through will give you a better feel for composition. Number 3. Z50. If you're looking for something a little more advanced, you can't go wrong with the Nikon Z50. While jumping into a higher-end model won't automatically make you a better photographer, this is one of the best cameras to start photography with if you're the kind of person who wants the latest tech and doesn't need as much hand-holding. A higher price tag also means you get a sturdier body with weather sealing, a tilting screen that can flip down for selfies, and a large high-res viewfinder for a clear view of your subjects. On top of that, a solid autofocus system and quick burst rate make it great for action photography, but if you don't know your way around a camera yet, some of these features may be a bit lost on you, and buying a more expensive body off the bat also leaves less room in your budget to buy different lenses. So if you're still unsure what kind of photos you enjoy taking, Number 2. Sony Alpha A6100. Sony cameras are known for their incredibly reliable autofocus, so the mid-range Sony Alpha 6100 is a great option if you want to shoot sports or moving subjects. Though its menu system takes some getting used to, the camera has plenty of customization options and a fairly simple button layout in a relatively compact form factor. Sony's Alpha lineup also tends to stand above the pack for battery life, at least among mirrorless cameras, which drain the battery faster than DSLRs like the Nikon D3500 above. For a little more money, the Sony Alpha 6400 will give you a sturdier, weather-sealed body and a higher resolution viewfinder. If, on the other hand, you're looking for something more affordable but set on getting a Sony camera, the older Sony Alpha 6000 still holds up surprisingly well, despite its less effective autofocus and low-res viewfinder. Number 1. Nikon D3500W. Though it was released back in 2018 and is getting harder to find new, the Nikon D3500 is still one of the best cameras for beginners, thanks to its unique interactive guide mode. Built right into the mode dial, the guide mode walks you through the camera's features in simplified terms, so you can learn the ropes of photography as you go. For someone just starting, this built-in learning resource can be invaluable. While it doesn't have some of the bells and whistles you'll find on newer, more advanced models, the D3500 has an excellent high-resolution sensor that punches above its weight, 
along with many high-quality lens options, so you'll still be able to take beautiful photos, older DSLRs like this, or even previous iterations.